Hi, everyone, and welcome back to the Sea Morning Show. We are fast approaching the final hour of our program, which, as Caroline mentioned, is leading us to our second discussion of the day. Now, if you love to travel and perhaps have photography as a hobby, mm -hmm. then perhaps we could put that together and being a travel photographer could be your perfect dream career. That would be my perfect dream career. I just don't know how to focus on my camera yet. Now, if one of does not inspire to be one, it could still become or it could still become a fulfilling hobby for you. Now, travel photography could not only be an outlet or a platform for self-expression, but it also benefits to visit the beneficial or the beneficial of it to visit various destinations across the globe and hunt of the best photo opportunities and experiences different cultures that could inspire and open one's eyes and mind. And our guest today has traveled across Indonesia and Southeast Asia to capture its beauty, and today he will also share his experiences. That's coming up in our discussion. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so as previously mentioned, joining us this morning is a travel photographer. His name is Ranar Pradipto. Good morning, Mas Ranar. Thank you for joining us. Hello. Today. Good Thank morning, you Caroline. Thank for coming. Paul. Great yeah. to have you. So first of all, the, the photos we, we saw earlier, yeah. you took uh -huh. those pictures. Yes. Amazing, by the uh, way. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe, like, I don't even know how you, you capture something. Are, are these images. one of it, too? No? Yeah, this, this, oh, this, wow. all this is all my photos. Oh, yeah. your yeah. photos. I travel a lot for taking this picture. Yeah, of course, definitely. So, you, which came first? I mean, did, did you <laughs> did you have a love for travel and then you, you, you started taking yeah, pictures? Yeah. Or were you already a photographer <laughs> and you decided to take travel photography as your career? Um, I love travel. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, from from my child, I um, I love about everything about uh, journey and art. Right. So uh, my 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 family uh, listened me to oh, you 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 traveling something, and then in college I start traveling, okay. and then until now because I love traveling, I quit from my job. Oh, my wow. major is civil engineering. Okay. Oh wow. And Very different. <laughs> <laughs> Very different. And then. I start full time as a travel photographer until now from 2016. Oh, so it's been quite some time. Yeah, but oh. love photography in 2007. Okay. okay. Um, you know, this is what I really want to capture because you, because photography, there's a lot of healing you know, genres and whatnot. What really captivate you to do, you know, this landscape and mm -hmm, seeing the mm -hmm. beauty? It seems that you're a very outdoorsy guy. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. love the nature, so I love the nature. you love, you know, that part of yourself. And yes. that's why you're taking pictures for it. Um, I love, uh, I choose travel because, um, yeah, yeah, uh, I can see many nature. Mm -hmm. I can, uh, I travel because I can uh, meet new people and yeah. see different things. And sometimes uh, I can go closer to the old man and say, uh, how are you? And I can uh, closer to and shoot the... Oh, so what? you ask the consent first, right? Yeah, so they can of course. Take a picture. Yeah. Were they kind of like suspicious at first because you know you were someone that they don't know? Yeah. Um, Especially going to inside like tribes and whatnot, you know the rural areas. Villages, villages yes. Yeah. Uh, the tribe. Are they welcoming uh, for you? Yeah. Sometimes, sometimes no. But uh, <laughs> photography is not just only taking a picture. Right. Photography is about you. You reach your mind. Reach, uh, reach your mind, reach uh, your literation to closer to someone. So, uh, if if I won't take a picture, uh, I need to be, yeah, make closer. Yeah. Uh, I, I need to well, be right? uh, blending to people. Yeah. And Getting then that after trust. that, yeah, yeah, and then get the trash. Uh, after get the trash, I can shoot. What so, is the message that you're trying to send for those that are seeing your pictures to your travel? Because there's so many things you can say, like, yeah. for example, what a beautiful landscape, or what beautiful people there are here, yeah, or right. what an interesting culture. What is it that you're trying to send uh, through your... I'm trying to send, like, uh, working as travel photographer, i always trying to sell, promote a destination. Okay. Mm -hmm. Like, when mm, I'm traveling to uh, a place, uh, in Indonesia, uh, I I working to promote this spot. Like mm -hmm. you see a landscape of Blitung uh, uh, example, and then I need to capture Blitung and then make the people coming to Blitung yeah. see it the way you see it yeah, and yeah, say yeah, you yeah, should yeah. want to be here and see this. Promote is yeah. the, the the most uh, important to travel for. Okay, I have yeah. a follow up question. The reason I ask is yeah. because mm -hmm. you majored in civil engineering. Mm. 
Your career is much, vastly different, but you do have to make a career out of it. So yeah. how is it that you turn this into a business? Who do you sell your photo uh, photos to? Yeah, yeah. Who do you work with? Uh, I think, first, I enjoy. I enjoy the, the photography. The business is later. Yeah, yeah, I don't know, like, uh, from college, like, at 20, uh, 2007, first I bring my camera, mm -hmm. I get my camera, and then, I, I don't know, photography, I, I love it's that. It's a passion. So, yeah. yeah, you can say the patient after that. Um, I asked my wife when, uh, before marriage, <laughs> can I uh, focus in photography? Okay, my wife says, uh, if you patient, if you uh, believe, yeah, just focus. Oh, you're and a lucky after man. That, after that, yeah, I'm focused. I'm branding. I make a personal branding year yeah. by year. Um, after that, yeah, I don't know, everything working. You know what this all comes back to? <laughs> right. It sort of all circles back to if you have your wife's support, then yeah, you're successful. Of course. Right? I know by the way, the wife yeah, at home is not the first home. This is the first wife, yeah. I believe, right? He, you know, that would be the okay. first wife, and then at home will be the second wife. Now, in regards to we're now living in an era where everybody is so accustomed to taking everybody. pictures, putting on social media and yeah. whatnot. Do you see that your career is somewhat challenging nowadays against you know, those that are probably not a Everyone photographer. Everyone has a phone. <laughs> yes, but they can just say, you know, they can just take a photo, yeah, edit yeah, it yeah, on yeah. their phone, yeah, and yeah, then yeah. they can place it. As opposed to you, it needs more technique, time, yeah. and time for you to create the literature yes. itself. Um, okay for that, but uh, we always, um, like, learn, because I learn uh, photography more than maybe uh, people who only bring a handful on there. Right? So, uh, I always believe like uh, I have the 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 place that uh, people need the professional uh, photo. Something. Right. Like, You'll always be able to provide yeah, yeah, like yeah. something on a different level yeah, as yeah. well. Now let's uh, let's start. Uh, for example, now you're ready to make your next journey. So next journey. what's the process? What's the thought process? First of all, how do you decide where you want to go? Yeah. And then what sort of preparations do you have to make? Uh, for example, how long would you have to go for? What sort of equipment would you need to bring? Take us through it. Like, uh, the way you travel is defines yourself. Like, okay. uh, I always choose what place that I want to go. That you personally yeah, want yeah, to Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I always choose. Uh, because the, the photography place is different. You need to uh, find the, the more specific, the more unique about a place. Mm -hmm. Like sometimes I go to Sumba uh, Island in Indonesia because of their culture. Mm. Yeah, in Sumba we can see like horsemen, yes. the tradition, Pasola festival. I go Sumba because of that. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I choose Sumba to go to make a photography. Mm -hmm. And then um, I said uh, photography is not only take a photo, we need to reach, we need to reach a uh, literation. Yeah. So before I go, I make uh, planning everything. Yeah. I never go. Be I never go to the place uh, without any information. Okay, so you do your yeah. research beforehand. Yeah, yeah. Research is the, the most important. It's not a spontaneous thing. Mm. No, like yeah. I just want to go to travel. Let's go. So that's what some people <laughs> yeah. think. Just pack right. my camera and yeah. go. Maybe it's the, yeah. like tourists. Tourists. Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Go. This, if mm. if you're working as travel photographer, we need to. Uh, research Schedule. everything. Like yeah. I go for five days, maybe I research for two weeks. Oh, oh. Yeah. So you do a lot more research. I open yes. Google, I see the photo have published, and right. everything. And is five days enough? Because you, I mean, he does have to get himself. You have to get yourself embedded with, let's say, yeah. the local villagers. Yeah, there. local. Is that usually enough? Five days, like less than a week. Five days. Yeah. yeah. Uh, sometimes I go by assignment. Ah, yeah, okay. not not go by myself. Right, I, right. I need uh, someone to support me or something. Yeah. Okay, um, for assignment, uh, my my boss. Uh, okay, runner, you go for only. We have uh, time only four days, okay. mm -hmm. and you need. Uh, we need uh, picture this, 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 this. Uh, yeah. uh, you need to get that. Yeah, yeah. Like I need assignment. make a uh, good itinerary and yes. everything. Very cool. No, yeah. I just wondered because you've been doing this since 2016 now mm -hmm. for seven years. Yes. You've been every part of Indonesia. Do you think uh, amongst those seven years that you already captured everything of the diverse beauty of Indonesia? No. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh Indonesia, my is, Indonesia is so so big. So yeah, huge. but. Uh, imagine you travel 38 province, mm -hmm. and yeah, it, we have 17, uh, we have 18 maybe, uh, 18,000 island. Yeah. Like, uh, I have uh, traveled for 
uh, seven or ten years explore Indonesia and not until Which now, one not, does not finish. you haven't touched, Mas Rana, that it's still... Haven't touched if you uh, tell about province. I think all province I've touched. You've touched, oh, okay, really? so you've been through all, all the way provinces. <laughs> oh my yeah. goodness. Do you have a favorite? My favorite, Papua is mm, amazing. Is most memorable. What part of it makes it more? Part of, uh, I go to Festival Lembah Bali. Okay. Mm -hmm. the, the place is in Wamena. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wamena is... Uh, uh, Papua Pegunungan, the okay. province name now. Uh, I coming, uh, I come there, I came there, and then I meet the tribe, and I see, oh beautiful, this is Indonesia. Mm. You can see many exot exotic face, and this is Indonesia. Yes, I just say, oh, this is Indonesia. I should very representative, yeah. very representative, yeah, yeah. diversity like, as well. We have many uh, different, uh, like I can say. Every province of Indonesia is different culture, different landscape. Uh, and then when you go to Papua in the uh, Papua Pegunungan, the landscape is very different. There's that uniqueness, like, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, uniqueness. Yeah. What do we want? Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Maybe one day, I mean, I have to be you know, ready for that. I mean, again, when you were talking about share or doing this photography, we've always say, also seen there's a lot of interest from international photographers. Yeah. Masrana. Yes. So do you become friends with them or you became associated yeah, yeah. with them yeah, or of course. it becomes kind of like your rival because yeah, of yeah, course yeah. you want a better picture and kind of better story? <laughs> photography, uh, learn photography is never mm, like uh, you, you go deep more in photography, you will meet many crazy photographers. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you will think like, oh, you only like, like small, very small. Mm. So. I, I have my favorite photographer, like, I favorite, uh, my favorite is Steve McCurry, okay. if you know. And then mm, many landscape photographers are all around the world. Mm -hmm. okay. yeah. So, uh, let's uh, meet your second wife. <laughs> let's. This, this, First is, wife. this is your ultimate tool. Do you only bring one camera and then many lenses? How does it work? How much equipment do you have to bring? Because yeah, like, I imagine you have to go to these hard to reach places, plus you're, you might be carrying a lot of we traveling uh, we for travel photography we it's depend on uh, uh, object okay like sometimes uh, i don't need bring the tele lens mm -hmm. uh, to to travel because uh, there is no object to shoot with tele lens such a long distance yeah yeah right? long, distance, long distance yeah distance. Uh, sometimes uh, i only bring one one body one lens something okay. like that it's enough for my work okay so but if you ask me about uh, what lens or what lens uh, I, I prepare, I bring in, in my traveling, I bring these three of. These are your three yeah, main yeah, ones. Could you explain main. them each one by one? This is white lens, okay. like 1535. Uh, this is for landscape photography. Okay. Then this is tele lens, like we can zoom it, something mm -hmm. like this. Uh, this is for uh, capture detail. And this is a fixed lens, uh, we can capture. Um, uh, Portrait photo, okay, mm. more up close. Kind yeah, of yeah. Okay, so there you very are technical. Basics and yes, <laughs> very expensive, I assume. Uh, yeah, <laughs> is it? Is it? Yeah. I mean, how how expensive is it? How expensive? Is it? Is it just an? In, what I, I guess investment? what I mean is, is it just an initial investment you make, and yeah. then this mm. equipment lasts a long time because it rarely gets outdated, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. So you don't have to keep buying new. Except products. if you want the new ones all the time. Yeah, you're yeah. coming out with new ones. <laughs> I think he gets the approval from yeah. the wife there. <laughs> if you need, uh, yeah, if uh, I need a uh, new lens, something for. If there's a job uh, and it requires. should be I required to buy a new one, okay. I buy. <laughs> That's what I would tell my wife. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah part job. of the job, <laughs> Indeed. So, uh, last but not least, before we conclude our, our discussion today, Masra, okay. and I'm pretty sure there's a lot of people, including myself, I think I'm very intrigued to become an official travel photographer. Mm -hmm. How we should, how would you say to all our viewers, like how we prepared ourselves? What would be the first, second, and third most uh, substantial that we need to be ready of? Um, to be a prof uh, to be a professional travel photographer, uh, I start from yeah long time like like uh, ten years, twelve years, fifty years. I start the, this this kind of my career. Mm. Uh, so for all the people, if you want to be a travel photographer, you need to be uh, uh, was it uh, you need to be always. Um, Focus, okay. and then you need to be love your job, yeah. and then you need to be uh, 
um, was it I uh, you need to be persistent okay patient <laughs> yeah. uh, and to you, you that perfect <laughs> okay. yes. I, yeah like it, you yeah. can't just get it anytime you want right. you yeah yeah lighting the yeah, something like that like yeah. you, you need to love your job after you love your job be patient and then you enjoy your job uh, I think you make your personal branding for like I year by year make a personal branding as travel photographer oh. so that uh, yeah everything coming and when you mean personal branding like create your portfolio yeah take good pictures make so that you have something to show your yes, client yes good for you yeah. <laughs> amazing very cool yeah, I, I think, I yeah, I think you're kind of like happy in your eyes, just look, twinkling your eyes. I always think I'm some sort of travel photographer, but then I get home and I look at all my pictures. I'm like, yeah, it's just pictures <laughs> of my kids. <laughs> like, okay. Why not? People okay. photography, right? Hey, why not? Indeed. Yeah. Right. Thank you so much, Masana, for coming Thank by. Thank you so much. I definitely you. love seeing your photos. When we yes. Can't How, where, do you have a social media account we could follow? Yeah, uh, my social media is Runner Predictor Indonesia. Okay, great. So I, I put Indonesia because I love Indonesia so much. Oh, there we go. We love <laughs> you Indonesia's for doing pride. that as well. Awesome stuff. Yes. So you guys make sure you guys check that out. All right. Thank so you. thank you very much, Mr. Anad. Thank you, I think me and P were going thank to you, kind of try to be better in photography. Why not, right? Even taking pictures of our children and family. <laughs> and of course, right now we're up for another short break. In the meantime, don't forget to follow our social media platforms. As you know, we're on Instagram, Twitter, and also YouTube for the latest updates. Stay tuned. We have many more to come right here in our show.